I feel like with social media, you're in charge of what you see. So depending on the post that you interact with, it can be either good or bad. So if you interact with a lot of models and celebrities and they make you feel bad about your appearance, um, then obviously it would create a negative space for you to be in. But if you interact with more positive stuff, you interact with say activist accounts and stuff like that, Islamic reminders and stuff like that, then it becomes a positive space for you to be in and you don't really get much negativity from it. Hi everyone, so good afternoon. Um, this is Ray speaking on behalf of Duba Team and Youth Center Malaysia and we'll be discussing today about social media, uh, the effects of social media on, young, on youth basically. We do have our two speakers for today. Okay, so let's start first like um, with introducing both of you guys. Uh, it's, way, it's way better if you guys will speak on your behalf. Uh, Assalamualaikum and good afternoon all. Um, as Ray mentioned, it, my name is Dr. Khadija Hassanah Abang Abdullah. Alright, Assalamualaikum. My name is Wardina Safia. So today I'll be discussing about the impact of social media on, in terms of mental aspect uh, with regards to youth and to our other youngsters because nowadays a lot of people are actually um, having difficulties adapting to the new environment that we're currently living in with the, with the new age of information. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to market because 